Ho oh, wow, it's me, your host, Mr. WG, and you're watching the spicy news. Dear subscribers, in today's video, I'm going to tell you about why the Akbari, a former deputy defense minister of Iran who alleged share information on senior officials, has been executed. Dear subscribers, Iran has executed a former deputy defense minister on allegations of spying for the United Kingdom. The judiciary's official news outlet confirmed on Saturday morning that Ali Raza Akbari, a British-Iranian dual national, was hanged after being convicted of corruption on earth and acting against national security by spying for British intelligence. It added that Akbari was earlier sentenced to death for harming the country's internal and external security by passing on intelligence. The actions of the British spy service in this case have shown the value of the convict, the importance of his access, and the enemy's trust in him it added. Dear subscribers, it claimed he had received training from the Mi-6 established shell companies to thwart Iranian intelligence services, had intelligence meetings in various countries including Austria and the UAE and received British citizenship as a reward for betraying his country. British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak called it a callous and cowardly act carried out by a barbaric regime with no respect for the human rights of their own people. Foreign Minister James cleverly said this barbaric act deserves condemnation in the strongest possible terms. This will not stand unchallenged. Dear subscribers, Akbari was alleged to have passed on information about dozens of senior Iranian officials, including Mohsin Fakhri Zada, a top nuclear scientist assassinated in a town near Tehran in 2020. Iran blamed the attack on Israel. According to Iranian judiciary, Akbari began working with British intelligence in 2004 for five years before leaving the country. In 2009, he was allegedly advised by the UK to leave Iran. Akbari then allegedly re-entered Iran several years later to continue his activities and was ultimately arrested. The judiciary did not announce the date of his arrest, but he was reportedly taken into custody in 2019. Dear subscribers, it is for today. I will meet you in next video. Till then, kindly subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Take care.